Hello, I'm Chris Menard. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Feel free to subscribe and ring the bell. In today's video, a new feature for OneNote is coming out. This is for OneNote for Windows users. If you're on a Mac, I believe you've already got this feature. So before I get into this, there will be chapters down below because this video is going to actually have three parts. Part one, I'm going to explain the six different versions of Microsoft OneNote. Part two, if you're a Windows user, you actually have two different desktop versions. I'll explain that. And then finally, part three that you can find in the chapters. If you are using Windows and just want to see this new feature, just jump there if you want to. Let's go ahead and dive into this video right now. So for OneNote, we've got six different versions of OneNote. OneNote for Windows, OneNote for the Mac, OneNote for the web, OneNote for the iPhone, OneNote for the iPad, and the last one is OneNote for Android. Those are the six different versions of OneNote. If you are using a Windows computer, you actually have two different versions of the desktop app. I have both running. I'm on a Windows computer today. You'll see both versions. And then we're going to talk about the new feature that's about to roll out. But for Windows users, the two versions, you have OneNote for Windows 10. And then you also have just OneNote. It, is, it was formerly called OneNote for 2016. Microsoft doesn't call it that anymore. They just call it OneNote. This is where, if you're a Windows user, most users are working. I don't see a lot of people using OneNote for Windows 10 anymore, but it is still available. So let me go ahead and pull up my screen right now. Okay, I've got both OneNotes running. First of all, here is OneNote for Windows 10. Easy to find because when you go to start and pull it up, it says OneNote for Windows 10 in the title bar. This has your notebooks, your sections, and your pages all listed over here on the left-hand side. The OneNote most users work in is just called OneNote. We used to call this OneNote Desktop or OneNote 2016. It is just OneNote. This is the default layout. My notebooks are over here. My sections are across the top. And my pages are over here to the right. So the new feature that is rolling out right now, and this came out in Jan around January 26. So if you don't have it yet, you will, is you can now come up to the View tab. And again, my pages are here. My sections are at the top. You've got a tab called the Layout tab. And when you come to the tab, Layout tab, horizontal is the default. But now we have vertical tabs. Watch this. So now here are all my notebooks over here in the far left. You can collapse and expand. I go to a section, EA Ignite is a section. These are my sections inside of my training notebook. And then here are your pages over here. And you can resize these. So now this is working a lot like OneNote for Windows 10. And I'm actually really liking this right now. I've already covered this video. You can also now sort your pages if you want to. So I'm going to go sort alphabetically. And you can see that that did work right there. Let me know if you like this new feature. You may not have it yet, but when you do get it, you're going to love it. I'm a big fan of this. I think it's an easier way to work for me. I appreciate your time. Feel free to subscribe. Ring the bell. Any questions about Microsoft OneNote? Let me know in the comments down below. Have a great day.